Hi everybody, it's Gemma, welcome back to Pampered Wolf. Today I'm going to be telling you how you can get the most beautiful, perfectly smooth skin on your body that you have ever had. Well, probably not like you've ever had because I'm assuming when you were born you had really, really soft skin. Smooth as a baby's bum. But I'm saying in recent years, probably the smoothest that you've ever had in previous years and I'm downplaying this now and I really shouldn't be because it's absolutely amazing. This is the best cream that I have found for anybody with dry skin, anybody with rough skin, anybody with dehydrated skin or bumpy skin absolutely phenomenal and I'm not the only one that's been trying this out. My mum has also given this her seal of approval as well. So double whammy, two thumbs up. Before I let you in on what this cream is and how fantastic it is and what it can do for you, if you are new here, hi, my name's Gemma. I am a fully qualified esthetician and lover of anything beauty, skincare and makeup. I upload videos on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays at 8 p.m. London time. And I'm also on Instagram if you want to check me out over there. It's at Pampered Wolf, all lowercase, no spaces. I would really appreciate it if you would consider clicking on that subscribe button and also the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. So let me just go into what this cream can actually do for you because this is not just a bog standard moisturizer that will hydrate and moisturize, which is very beneficial, but this cream does so much more. So this will remove any dead skin cells, which is absolutely fantastic because your skin will look much more glowy and much more youthful and a lot less dull. This will also unblock hair follicles, which is extremely beneficial for me. I don't know about you, but every time I shave my legs or get a wax, I tend to get a lot of ingrowing hairs and that has not happened since I've been using this cream, which is a serious, serious positive for me. This will also promote surface skin cell renewal and it intensely hydrates. It obviously softens and smooths because that's what a moisturizer tends to do. And it will improve the appearance of rough, dry, bumpy skin, which is also known as chicken skin or keratosis pilaris. So what is keratosis pilaris? Now, I would think you would know if you had this condition, but just in case you've mistaken it for something else, I'm gonna put a picture of it on the screen for you now so you can take a really good look. Keratosis pilaris is a very common, extremely common genetic condition of the skin that affects the hair follicles. It can cause small raised bumps like chicken skin on the upper arms, the thighs, the back, the buttocks, the face, but on the face it's often mistaken for acne. It can also occur on the hands and other body areas, but it's less common within those areas. It can cause possible itchiness and irritation. It can have varying degrees of inflammation or redness but it can also cause no irritation at all. You may just have the little raised bumps on the skin. So the causes of keratosis pilaris aren't 100% understood yet, but we do think that one of the major causes is the body producing excess amounts of the skin protein keratin, which then surrounds and traps the hair follicle in the pore, causing a small little bump. The most beneficial treatments for keratosis pilaris include ingredients like urea, lactic acid, glycolic acid, salicylic acid, vitamin D, fish oil, and topical retinoids. So let's get down to it. What do I actually recommend? Now you don't have to have keratosis pilaris to actually use this cream. This cream is extremely beneficial for absolutely everybody, especially those with a dehydrated or a dry skin because this will smooth and soften, it will hydrate, it will exfoliate and generally make your skin look far more youthful than it already does. And I thought I had pretty good skin before I started using this cream and I have seen a difference. So this is Ameliorate Transforming Body Lotion. It's unbelievable. This one has some fragrance and essential oils in it. I didn't realize they did a fragrance-free version until I'd actually bought this version and I was kicking myself when I'd actually looked at the website. This one is the most common one, the one with the fragrance in, but again, you can get the one that is fragrance-free, but I think they only sell it in a really big bottle, but that's the one that I will be buying next time. Even though I don't feel like the fragrance in this product is overpowering in any way, and I do really like to use a body cream with a scent in, I probably shouldn't, but I do. The fragrance in this, I don't find it overly pleasant either. It's really not for me. It's personal preference. My mum does feel the same though. It's not a really lovely, lush smelling cream. 
You may absolutely love it, but we personally don't. But the cream itself is worth overlooking the smell. It's The cream is absolutely amazing. So this is a beautiful lightweight cream and a little goes a very long way. Don't make the same mistake that I did and put loads on on day one because you really don't need to. It's a waste of the product and also you'll feel a little sticky and greasy for a while. This really doesn't leave a sticky, greasy residue on the skin if you use the right amount. So if you have a look here, you need possibly around about that much product, which is a very small amount of product for the entire arm. So you will get a lot out of this. So I like to dot it and then make sure I get it everywhere. As soon as it hits the heat of the skin, it just turns more liquidy so you can spread it a lot further. I try not to forget underneath the arms because that's where I get a little bit of bumpy skin on the hands and I've still got a tiny bit on my fingers and I've literally done the entire arm so I'll just pop a little bit on my shoulder. This is so so beautiful. I actually don't find the scent you know repulsive. It's a it's a nice pleasant scent but um, it's just not my preference. So you'd apply this once a day. I tend to apply it when I've got out of the bath in the evening. You apply this twice a day if you have keratosis pilaris. So once a day, twice a day over the affected areas if you do suffer from keratosis pilaris. And I guarantee you will see an improvement in your skin. So this has vitamin E in here, which is a great antioxidant. It contains the unique LAH6 skin hydration complex. So it's really, really hydrating. It's got lactic acid and urea in here, which are great exfoliating and hydrating properties. Squalane and glycerin and sweet almond oil which are great to hydrate and moisturize and smooth shea butter and cocoa butter which are beautiful humectant and emollient and occlusive ingredients so treble whammy it's got a bunch of soothing ingredients in here as well and it's just oh, it's just absolutely amazing i love it and it's completely soaked into my skin now no sticky residue whatsoever no slippy feeling I did apply far too much on day one and it gave me that you know when you put on, on too much fake tan and you tend to be a little sticky and tacky and you get a bit cold because you've got a damp skin continuously throughout the day. It gave me that sort of feeling and I didn't like it. Day two, my skin felt amazing. So I thought actually it's worth trying this out again. So I applied far less and it still works. It's still amazing. Doesn't give you that sticky residue. It just leaves you with a super soft feeling. I cannot rave about this cream enough. It's absolutely fantastic. And to top it off, I've got no more ingrowing hairs on my legs anymore. And underneath my arms where I did get a little bit of bumpiness, all gone. Now I will say that if you are going to be using this cream, you need to be extremely careful if you're going outside or you're sitting near a window because AHAs can sensitize the skin to sun damage. So you need to make sure that you are protecting your skin against that sun damage and use a high factor sunscreen that is 30 or above on the areas of skin that are going to be shown when you go outside or you're sat next to a window. So I'm gonna shut up about it now because I tend to wax on about things that I absolutely love and then people think it's sponsored content and I can guarantee this is not sponsored content. I have not been paid to say any of this information. I also bought this with my own money. It didn't even appear in PR. So um, it's a great cream and this is 100% my opinion and also the opinion of my mum as well, if you're interested. So um, hope you've really enjoyed this video. Hope to see you all in the next one. Bye everyone.